We begin by lighting our candle to remember God's light is with us wherever we are. And it's epiphany when we hear the stories of people realizing or discovering who Jesus was and what he meant. But it's not just stories in the Bible. There's lots of other things in the Bible too. There's rules and there's poems and there's prophecies and there's history and there's wondering. And one of Jesus's friends called John wrote down some of his wonderings about who Jesus was and what he meant. He wrote, in the beginning was the word. Jesus was the word of God and the word was with God and the word was God. Jesus, John wondered, was with God when the world was made and God made the world through him and with him and with his help and everything that is in the world was made with Jesus and through Jesus, the word of God. In him was life and that life was light and the light shines in the darkness and the darkness does not overcome it. And then John wondered, who understood about Jesus? Who knew about Jesus? He remembered another John, John the Baptist, who came before Jesus and told the people, get ready because the one you've been waiting for is coming. Maybe this John understood. Jesus was born into the world, John wondered, but the world didn't understand who he was. The God who made the world was now part of the world. God made the world with Jesus and now Jesus was in the world that he had made. And John wondered about this. John wondered, the word became flesh. God's word became a human being and lived among us as beautiful as a beloved child. And now we're going to wander. And if you want to pause the video to wander with the people that you're with, you can do that too. I wonder what your favorite part of this reading was. I wonder what the most important part of this reading was. We heard about Jesus as the word and as the light and as flesh, the human baby. I wonder which of these ways of understanding Jesus is your favorite. I wonder why it's your favorite. I wonder what it means to say the light shines in the darkness and the darkness doesn't overcome it. I wonder how John the Baptist knew who Jesus was and understood what he meant. I wonder why the other John, Jesus' friend, decided to write down his wanderings about Jesus. I wonder if you'd like to write down any wanderings or thoughts or ideas that you have about Jesus. I wonder what part of this reading is for you?
I wonder if there's anything in your house that you'd like to use to make something or play with this reading. And we can keep wandering throughout the week, but for now, our reading is finished.